In today's video, we're going to talk about calibrating your studio monitors for a constant volume level. Working at a consistent volume level is important so that your mixes and masters translate well to everybody else's speakers. In a large room, you can set your volume level to around 85 dB SPL. In a small room, you want to set your volume level to around 79 dB. All you need to do to set your speaker volume is use two simple tools, an SPL meter and a tone generator from your DAW. One type of SPL meter is an inexpensive analog SPL meter like this one. These are about $30 to $50 and they'll do the job. Another type of SPL meter is a fancier digital meter like this. These are more expensive. They're not any better for what we're trying to do, but they have more features. You could also use an SPL meter in a smartphone app. However, they're not as accurate, but they are consistent, which is what we need for this type of measurement. To use our SPL meter, we're going to set the weighting to C weighting. C weighting is just the way that our ears hear frequencies, and we're going to set the response time to slow. When we set our scale here to say, for instance, 80 dB, when the meter is at zero, it's 80 dB SPL in the room. When it's above or below, it tells us the number above or below. We're going to set up the meter between our speakers pointing up approximately at ear height and our listening position. So in Pro Tools, I'm going to set up a signal generator with pink noise playing at minus 20. So there's our pink noise set to minus 20. I'm also going to set up a trim plugin that's just there so that I can mute one channel at a time because we only want to measure one channel at a time. So I'm going to set this pink noise to read 79 dB on my SPL meter. Now I'm going to switch to my other speaker and play 79 dB out of that speaker and make sure they're identical. Okay, so both speakers are set to 79 dB. Now our monitors are calibrated. We don't want to adjust our speaker volume from now on while we're mixing. So remember to find a comfortable volume level in your room, measure it with your SPL meter, make a note of it, and constantly work at that level. Maintaining consistency in the way you work is going to make your mixes and masters translate better to everybody else out there. Also remember to set up your speakers properly and if necessary calibrate using SonarWorks room correction to get your speakers sounding their best in your room. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for our next video where we're going to talk about mixing and mastering for the right loudness level inside your DAW.